Hello and welcome back to No Man's Sky, everybody. This is Elon Paul. Doing a short video here. Just want to let folks know what's basically going on today in regards to the weekend mission. Now, it is Sunday. It is the 1st of January, 2023, but a lot of people have already done it. I wanted to just do a quick run through and show you the uh, basics involved in regards to doing the weekend mission run through over on the anomaly for extra quicksilver usually about 1800 quicksilver is what you get out of this and it's uh, it's kind of worth it to do it so let's give it a shot and see what it's like today uh, not so sure what's going on with the audio on this but I'm gonna check that out right now looks like my audio is on but for some reason we're not doing it right let me check something real quick here It's there, just real quiet. Yeah, they're in there. For some reason, the audio is just real quiet for some reason. Okay. So this is my regular save, in case you're all wondering about it. So we're going to take a trip to the anomaly. I'm not going to get to it that way. So let's go take my one of my ships... Usually there's at least one sitting in here waiting for me. Uh, let's see. I haven't taken the living, sh living ship in a while. And hopefully this will be a quick video. Hey, we're not facing the planet today. What do you know? Happens every other save. I don't know. I have no idea why. I could close this out and start again, and it will be facing the planet. I don't get it. Don't mind the glitch, though. It comes in handy for certain reasons. But I'm not going to get into that just yet. Okay. Let's see what's going on in here. Now, I've got it on single player at the moment. Multiplayer is turned off. I do that purposely because... Uh, Sometimes there's a little too much going on. It makes the video processor kind of go a little crazy. So my GPU can not can handle it, but when I'm doing everything all at once, it tends to make it a little more difficult. So, no big deal. All right. <clears throat> Let's see what we got. Uh, unearthing ancient bones. 1800 quicksilver. Not bad. Let's go ahead and do the weekend event. And we're going to start the mission. Oh, good. Nobody else joined me. I'm just kidding. Okay. And away we go. Now, I keep the video, uh, the audio down in the game a little bit because it tends to get a little bit overwhelming at times. It's like a three-eyed blob floating through space. I don't know. I don't mind having a living ship, I'll be honest. It's not my favorite craft. My favorite, if everyone's ever been watching, has always been the uh, solar ships. Before that, it's the hot rod fighters. <clears throat> I like the hot rods. Okay, we're here. Where to? Uh, looks like there. Bone rich planet. Huh. Got quite the distance to travel to get there. A minute just real time just in order to get there. Let's jump out and jump back in as soon as we arrive. I'll be right back. And we're just about there. And of course it's going someplace other than where I wish to go. There we go. Now, I haven't scanned the planet, as you can imagine. 
I'm going to take a stab here and say that this is going to be... Oh, whoa. Hey, look out. Okay. Ugh. An aggressive sentinel planet. Let's see if I can't find a, some place a little bit more convenient to park. Ah. <laughs> uh, if you're talking about conveniences... Yes, that works. And we're here. Let's take a look, shall we? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cut that out. Okay, let's see. Sentinels require... Okay. Well, if you say so. And that way. So it looks like we've got a lot of bones floating around. Okay, let's do it. So, just a matter of digging up some bones. Now, sometimes when you're digging things up, if it was like scrap or something along those lines, you'd have to worry about um, corrupted sentinels attacking you. But it looks like we don't have to worry about that here. This is just going to be a lot of flogging around and checking out everything that's on it. Now, this tends to be a hot planet, as you can see. I got plenty of phosphorus. Whoops to get me going. Matter of fact, if there's phosphorus on this planet and deposits, I might just check those out. Uh, what do we got? Selenium, copper, ah, phosphorus, what do you know? Yep, yeah, okay. So, this is what it involves. It basically just involves running over here, <clears throat> digging through the ground. I always go into the widest setting because half the time there will be more than one set of bones here. Looks like we've got a good one here. Uh, 813 years old, that's pretty cool. No, I don't want to be on the ship, thanks. Eh, not bad. Good charge. It's not like I need the money right now, but the... But, the, uh, but most definitely the Quicksilver is what I'm after here. There are ways to um, acquire more Quicksilver, and I know a lot of the other gamers out there that play No Man's Sky um, have certain ways to glitch extra, but I'm perfectly fine with doing these when I can. I haven't purchased everything in the Quicksilver. Oh, wow. I can't even get through between these guys. Okay. Well, bye, guys. Let's go down. It won't even let me go underneath them. Okay. That's pretty bad. So I have to go up and over or around them to get to this next set of bones. Okay. So there doesn't seem to be much to this particular And you want to check real carefully because there could be other stuff here. Again, there's a lot of times you'll find more than one bone in any particular area. That's just one of those little cheap bones. Eh, I'll go ahead and grab that too while I'm here. Okay. And the next one is going to be there. Okay, so I'm going to continue this on. We have to get 12 of these, and I'll pick you up every single time I go to go to a site, and we'll be right back. Okay, we're at the next site, and as you can see here, as I get closer, we're discovering more. So there's going to be three sets of bones here. Really? Bye. Okay, these are the cheap bones, but we'll pick them up. This is up to five. And, okay, where's our next one? Too weak to find. So, I'll go ahead and head in the direction, and, of course, I'll pick you back up when we find the next set. And we're back at the next one, and as we can see, we've got a few here as well. And just plow around real fast here. We'll get them all. And it looks like just standard ones as well. Yeah, that's a pretty standard one right there. And another standard one. Special. Alright, that says too weak to figure it out. So, I'm going to go ahead and pick you guys up here in just a couple more moments. And we're back once again, and as you can see, I've landed into a nice little spot here that has five bones in it. We only need four. We'll get them all because, well, that's just what we're going to do. And it looks like they're pretty standard. One, two... Three. Oh, except for that one. That one's going to be a special one. Four. 
and 5. Rare item, 793. So that'll be worth a little bit more. And as you can see, I do have to deliver the bones to a local osteologist. Blah, 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 blah. Can't talk right now. Let's pull my ship in. How about we pull in a different ship? Because like I said, not always my favorite. Uh, Hand of Death. It's red. Doesn't really go with my uh, color scheme anymore, but it's okay. He's a good ship. And, uh, yeah, what the heck? Well, that's interesting. He's turned into a tree ornament of some sort. Okay, let's try someone different. Let's try... There was another bone over here I missed. There was. Yeah, what do you know? So there were six bones over here. That's pretty cool. Alright, let's go over here while we try to figure out why my ship... Oh man, it looks like a bat swooping down, doesn't it? It's pretty cool looking, actually. I do like this. Hey, what's up, Sentinel? Alright. So we're going to get in. We're going to do that scan. I don't want to fight them on the ground. I'll fight them here, rather than on the ground. And if any of you have seen any of my uh, games where I've had to fight them... Oh, of course there's going to be an incoming storm. Haven't had an incoming storm the whole time. Come on. Goodbye. Goodbye. Next. Who wants to fight? Goodbye. Goodbye. Next. Okay, who's next? Where'd he go? There you go. Hi. Goodbye. There was one more. I know there was. Drop in there. Oh, went all the way down there. That's weird. Hi, guys. Bye. Bye. Who's next? Erased. Erased. Goodbye. Oh, you, huh? Well, let's get rid of your friends first. Because they're just going to cause me issues. Oh, nice. You want to play, huh? Now, remember, I can float for a long time, my friend. Who's next? Hi, there you are. See, I got a laser beam too that can hit pretty hard. Goodbye. I'll take that. Alright, did we get any, uh... Cargo? No? You know what? You guys want to play? We're gonna play. Let's dance, buddies. Bye. And bye. Where's that Mac at? Oh, nice. Guess what? I got one of those. No, I don't want your Girl Scout cookies, my friend. You're out of here. Who's next? Anybody? It's okay. I don't mind playing. Ah, there you are. Hi. you a little bit. Okay. Let's end this. Hi. I need your brain. And 
Bye. Yeah. Really? You guys should be done. Why aren't these guys stopping? Who's left? Oh, that's why. You. There we go. Much better. Local area network has been disabled. No, you don't have to go through all that. Alright. I think we've got just about everything. Ah, uh, even if there's something left over here, I really don't care. Nothing left to uh, intercept, my friends. All right. So, sorry about that. Let's hit that C button again. Over here? Okay. Now, had we taken to the air, someone would have just... Uh, th then the authorities would have shown up in ships instead. And, eh, as much as I like it, and this thing is, you know, obviously... You know, 62,000 damage, I can take him out pretty quick. I'd rather take him out with this weapon that I've got, which has uh, also got about uh, 30,000 damage. So it's a little OP on itself. All right, let's go talk to this uh, fellow real quick, and we'll end this. Ah, uh, life's most visor twinkles. They seem pleased to see me, but less interested in my company than the prospect of analyzing the bones I have excavated. Let's show the samples. Corex selects a sample of bone matter, swiftly analyzing it with a module built into their carapace. Returning the bones, they transmit the scan data directly into my suit, ready to deliver to the Nexus. And we're done. So yeah, I mean, the whole video here is about 18 minutes long, but, uh, you know, honestly, it's uh, it's not a big deal. And uh, where'd my ship go? It should be right here. He's hiding. Oh, look at all the bones nearby. Wasn't that stupid? Okay. Well, anyway. Ship, ship, ship. Where is my ship? Hi. Right there. Up on the hill. Yeah. I, mean, I should have chose the blue one rather than the red one. He blends into the landscape. Let's go up to the Nexus and claim our reward and we'll call it. So that's basically what these uh, Nexus mix missions are like. Um, they're enjoyable. Especially if you have, if you have the right the tools to do the job, um, and I always like it a good sentinel battle, as you might know. Them and their Girl Scout cookies. It's either that, or I think they might be selling an extended warranty for my vehicle. And frankly, my vehicle doesn't require an extended warranty. And there we go. Boom. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the end of the Nexus mission. Let's go ahead and claim the reward. There it is. Complete the mission. And that is, as they say, it. Now you could go back in here and grab other missions. They're always going to have some Quicksilver missions, but you can only get three of those. You can only save up to three of those in one run. So if I do all three missions, if I do three missions in a row after this, it'll take up all three of those icons. I won't get any more Quicksilver missions after that. And of course, as you may or may not know, you come over here to this Quicksilver dude over here. You can either collect your Expedition Award rewards. As you know, we've been going through the Redux. The Twitch rewards, because we do have Twitch drops once in a while. Or you can just go ahead and create items from Quicksilver to begin with. And you can get any one of these lovely decorations, things for your ships, decals, etc., 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 and it just keeps going forever. Okay, so that is it. I hope you enjoyed this, and if you'd like, 
if you really liked the uh, video, please, by all means, hit that like icon. And, hey, always love a good, uh, good subscriber or two if you guys want to join up. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Always be kind in all things that you do. Always be truthful to yourself. Thank you very much.